people call it stunts. For me, it's just a way to get over an obstacle. Uh, and the style you put in is uh, your own style, you know. It's uh, it's not really stunt. It's calculated for sure, and that doesn't make it a stunt because stunts sometimes aren't calculated. Uh, because maybe if you want to break a record, you will crash. In this case, I know exactly what I'm doing, and in a competition, the the the, the goal of. Uh, uh, competition is not to put any foot on the ground so you have to get on the obstacle without putting your foot on the ground and that's just uh, what I do to be world champion uh, for the eighth time is uh, it's an honor that's for sure and I uh, I work for it very hard so uh, I think I deserve it but uh, of course I try to uh, I try to keep my title and that's the hardest part, you know, to get it is one thing, to keep it is, uh, is another thing. I have several trainings. First of all, what you see here is uh, training on the bike, so uh, simul simulate competitions. After that, I do the physical training, the endurance. Another part is my my strength. So uh, I have to I have to be very explosive, as you see. We we jump uh, from the ground one meter, 35 centimeters. So you can't just do it with only riding a bike. You really have to go a lot to gym, and after that. Uh, Ride a lot of competitions to have a good uh, experience. I did one stunt. Uh, it was in Brussels in a, on a snowboard competition. Uh, there was a high wall, six meters high, and a little lower they had a statue of three meters, and I jumped from the wall to the statue to the ground. So. In, in one time actually and my wheel was bent my back hurt a little bit and I was still alive and people loved it so in that point you can do stunts 